when and where am I going to meet that special lady that I'm marrying? Your name is Michael, right? Yes. Well, first off, I would tell you to take some time from the last relationship, which was a bit crazy, yeah? All uh, right, didn't go well. Yeah, it didn't go well. Very hard to please lady, correct? Uh, yeah, you can say that. Yeah, very hard to please. So, um, she was not very nice at times. So, uh, verbally, verbally biting, yeah? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So, I would give yourself some time in between that and the next one because you really need to recover your personal self-esteem from that. Even though you feel that you're this warrior strength inside, which you are, yet she really did a number on your heart and your trust. Yeah, so give yourself some time after that. I would say within a year to a year and a half, there'll be another person, but you need to be careful on how you pick, okay? Do yourself a favor, Mike. Make sure that the woman that you choose has all the characteristics and quality of what you want. Because if you don't wait for that, you're gonna get in the same situation again. And I can see you have, I can see you doing that. So this is a, you know, this is a bit of a, you know, a lesson for you to learn. You know, write down your list, your pros, your cons. Make sure that you get all the pros on your list before you jump into something seriously. You know, you have that big, great structure about you, but in the inside, you're like a half-roasted marshmallow. You know, so it's easy for to, for for a woman to uh, to to gain your trust and your 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 love because you wear your heart on your sleeve. So I would, I'd wear long sleeves for a bit is all I'm telling you. Okay. All right, you need to heal from this, okay? If you don't get your self-esteem and your trust up within yourself before you get into another relationship, you're gonna get into the same cyclical thing that you, you're trying to get yourself out of. Okay? So, and the relationship you're getting out of now You've been very much blamed that everything's your fault, correct? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes, I have. Right. So I'm just telling you right now, from what I can see that went on in the relationship, that's not the case at all. And you're the, you're, you have honor about you, and because of your honor you know, and your integrity, you've, you've taken on the blame just to smooth things over, just to get through it. And you, you, it, it, it's eating you alive, literally. And I'm, so I just want to, before I hang up, I just want you to know that what I see in the relationship, it was a definitely 50-50. And to be honest, that's more like 60 her, 40 you, because you did everything you could to try to please this woman, and it was not happening no matter what you did. You know, and when you got backed into a corner, you know, what are you supposed to do? That's the way I see it. Yeah. All right. You know, do you understand everything I just said? Yeah, I understand, Jim. Okay, good. Good. Exactly, mm -hmm. because then you're going to get the quality you want and need to have something long-term. Because I get that you really want a long-term relationship, correct? Oh yeah, that's what I'm after. Right, right. You want a family, you want the house, you want the white picket fence, you want the whole thing. Okay, because you're an right. old-fashioned, traditional, moral, honorable guy. Okay, but to get all those things, you have to pick the right woman, and to do that, you have to be happy with oneself. Okay. Well, good luck to you, Mike. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Bye. I mean, it's very, very hard in the relationship, what I saw in his relationship, is she really did a number on him. You know, she kind of danced all over his heart and didn't care and walked away and, you know, blamed him for everything. And because he is an honorable guy, he kind of went, okay, 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 okay. And he tried to make it better just by giving into everything. And that's it's not it was never going to work anyway mm -hmm. so well he's used to being in a relationship everybody wants to be loved and accepted everybody it's a human quality okay but for him he needs to take some time for himself he doesn't really know who he is he knows what he wants but he doesn't know who he is and in that when he gets in a relationship with someone else he doesn't necessarily fit mm -hmm. because he doesn't know who he is 100 <laughs> percent